Good morning, everybody. Welcome to Rise and Shine. <clears throat> you know, this morning I want to talk to you about grace. Grace in its abundance. Grace on top of grace on top of grace. In John, the chapter John, in John, the book of John, chapter 1, verse 16, this is what it says. Out of the fullness, we have been all received grace. Now, let me repeat that. Out of, out of his fullness, we have all received grace. And then it goes on to say, in place of grace, already given grace. We have so much grace. The Holy Spirit just gives you more grace, more grace, more grace. And then if you back this verse up and you go to verse 14, instead of verse 16, this is what it says, who came from the Father, full of grace, Jesus, full of grace. You see, God gives you so much grace. We don't need to pray for it. We don't need to beg for it. We don't need to ask for it because it's there for us every day. It's there for us every minute of the day. His fullness is so full of grace, it just falls all over you. There is enough grace in your life to do anything and everything for every task you may have to walk through for every sadness you have to go through, for every joy you have to go through. There is grace in your life. So remember, you don't have to pray for it. You don't have to beg for it. Grace is there sufficiently, more than sufficiently for you. Because the God tells, Jesus tells Paul, he tells him, my grace is sufficient for you. Wow, that was Paul. How much more do we have? We have the Holy Spirit in us. We have the faith of grace that's in our hearts. So remember, faith is for you. It's in you. Amen. Let me pray for you. If, it's if, you, can't, if you need mercy, if you feel like you need mercy and grace in your life, let me pray. Oh, Heavenly Father, help me to know that I have grace already. If you have poured your grace out on me, you poured your love on me, you poured your blessings on me, and that I have enough grace, mercy, and love in my life to walk every day, no matter what it is I'm walking through. I thank you, Lord God, for healing in my body, that I know you are my healer because your word says I am the Lord God who healed you. So, Lord God, I thank you for hurt necks that... that um, are healed in Jesus' name, migraine headaches that leave this body in Jesus' name, and earaches that have to leave in Jesus' name. I thank you for court favor in Jesus' name. I thank you, Lord God, for knees that are healed in Jesus' name, ankles and muscles that have to return to normal, and the inflammation has to leave now in Jesus' name. Amen and amen. Go out and make it a great rise and shine day, and I'll talk to you tomorrow. Bye-bye.